Sean's View Entertainment on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe. I felt that it was fitting. I felt that it was right. And it was, it was the right time that with Kurt Cobain's montage of heck documentary coming out recently, hugely successful, very popular. I'm a fan of his music, but I wanted to get into more detail, wanted to know more about his background, wanted to know more about his upbringing, wanted to know more about Kurt Cobain, the performer, the singer, the person that he was. So I went out to FYE, FYE today, and yes, I already did watch the uh, Kurt Cobain documentary. Like I said, I, I got to give it definitely four out of five stars. A very solid documentary, and I urge anyone that hasn't seen it to go see it right now. Um, so I went into FYE today, and I bought the following. In no particular order, ladies and gentlemen, got the Nirvana Nevermind CD, twelve ninety nine. I know you can buy these online for a little bit cheaper, but when it comes down to it, when you're talking about you know extra fees and talking about the shipping and all the other calculations, so there it is, ladies and gentlemen, and from FI. And there's of course all the songs on the back. And um, you know, I, I mean, I was a fan of his music before, but after seeing that you know that documentary montage, montage of heck, that really uh, drew me in. Uh, pretty much. So here we go in another CD here. This features some unreleased, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, it's uh, three previously unreleased tracks. So, hey, maybe there's some songs I don't know about Kurt Cobain and, you know, what he brought to the table and what he featured. And you got some acoustics here. You got some live. You got some studio. You got a lot of things. It's from the uh, Sliver, the best of the uh, tapes here. I mean, the tape collection, I mean. And then, of course... Last but certainly not least, it would not be complete without the Nirvana Bleach. Nirvana Bleach 20th Anniversary CD. The 20th Anniversary, and um, I can only imagine what this is going to sound like when I pop it in, and I don't know what to expect there. It comes with a 52-page booklet featuring many unseen photos never, be, never before released. Complete live performance from February 9th, 1990, and definitely... One of the most familiar singers of that era and of the 90s was Nirvana. And until he um, sadly and tragically passed away. But um, yes, there it is, ladies and gentlemen. I think it's a pretty damn good collection. It's awesome to have. And if you're a fan and if you grew to be a fan after watching that documentary on Kurt Cobain recently, um, I definitely urge you to go out and, and buy these. And it's you know worth every penny in my estimation. So... Um, you know what? He changed the game, did Nirvana, and uh, there'll never be another like him. And, um, yeah, I'm going to go listen to these right now. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll go open them up, and uh, maybe I'll open them up in another episode. Maybe not. I don't know. I just wanted to showcase these to the subscribers and viewers here on the Sean Show, where it doesn't always have to be about wrestling. It can be about music. It can be about video games. It can be about my thoughts, my opinions on whatever and whenever. Whatever I want to say, whatever I want to do on these particular episodes, that's what we can do. So there it is. Do you have these CDs? Do you like them? Are you a fan of him? Are you a fan of somebody else? Um... Like I said, he, he changed the game in more ways than one in the 90s. Your comments, your opinions, subscribe.